Good afternoon, everybody. We just arrived at a place. <laughs> I don't know where we are. So we're somewhere um, <laughs> here to get my sewing machine looked at. This guy had really good reviews on Yelp and I thought it was gonna be like a little shop, but it's actually, I think this is where he lives. Um, we're on A Street and it looks like an apartment or something or other. So we will see how this goes. I really have no idea what to expect, but um, I'm hoping he can look at my machine. It's called Derek's Sewing Repair and I just found him online. So we will see. <laughs> Scare me. <laughs> You're kicking Olive. Hey. <laughs> so we are back from taking my sewing machine to get looked at. The guy actually ended up being really nice. He was young. He was like our age. I don't know how to describe him. He had like longer hair. He was covered in tattoos. He had some pretty cool tattoos of like an old sewing machine and then some like sewing machine stitches that you can do. It's sort of cool. Um, but he was really nice. He took a quick look at my machine. He said that I could give it to him to be fully serviced but the turnaround time would be about a week. And I just feel like, number one, I don't feel like my machine needs to be fully serviced. I just thought that there was like something wrong with it um, that was easy to be fixed. And I can't wait a week. So I kind of showed him what I thought was the problem. And sure enough, the, the little piece that the bobbin goes in was completely turned the wrong way. So he had to actually unscrew my machine, lift a piece off, and then he was just able to reposition it into the right position and unjam it. So that's why everything was jammed up and locked and not able to move. So I'm really glad that he was able to do that. Now, now I need to figure out how the heck to work the machine. So um, I think tonight I'm gonna pretty much just be trying to figure out how to use it. I'm hoping that I could get the last three headbands sewn tonight. And if I can, then I can take pictures of them tomorrow and then fingers crossed get my shop open no later than Friday. So that is my goal and I really, really hope that I don't run into any other problems. The way things are going, I probably will but this girl is a monkey scout you're crazy i can't really like trust her on a couch anymore because she just like wants to dive off of it you're crazy and if you guys haven't noticed this place is really really small and it has these tile floors i don't really know what to do i don't feel like it's a good floor for scout to learn how to crawl on and when she learns how to walk, that would be really scary too. Um, we have a rug that hopefully we can get soon and put down, but it's not a very padded rug. It's pretty thin. So, hmm, I don't know. It's kind of a bummer that there's no carpet in here. I feel like we don't really have a good floor for her to like crawl around on. Huh? Huh? What? <laughs> it's dinner time for this girl huh it's dinner time oh thank you were you sharing that was so nice oh thank you you guys she's sharing oh thank you <laughs> uh oh you guys look who came to visit Larry is not supposed to be down here. Uh-oh. And Olive is so sad because she wants out there. Can you guys see him? <laughs> All right, you guys, this girl had some peas and sweet potatoes. And I have turned the machine on officially for the very first time. This lit up, and I don't know what any of this means. So... I am gonna experiment. I think it's working. Oh my gosh. 
I think I am having success. <laughs> so I, the first thing that I sewed was the little elastic strap for the back of one of the headbands and it was going really good, but as soon as I started sewing through the elastic, the needle jammed and then came out and then when it tried to go back in, it completely bent the needle. I was like, are you kidding me? <laughs> Luckily, there were more needles stored in the sewing machine. So I was really relieved that there were more needles. I obviously need to stock up on needles, but I'm thinking that the needle that was currently on the machine um, is probably really old. I don't know how old, but it was probably dull and just wasn't sharp enough to like go through the elastic. So once I changed the needle, put a brand new one on, everything went good. So I'm gonna get to sewing. I have three headbands. I'm really hoping nothing else goes wrong. So wish me luck. Scout is taking a nap and I am going to sew. You spotted me. <laughs> what are you doing in here? Are you playing? <laughs> Is that funny? <laughs> All right, you guys, I finished. Hallelujah. I mean, if this is going to be my new job, then I better not complain. But I think it was just because I was like, I told Josh, I'm on my first date with this machine. Like, I'm getting to know this machine. So I kind of took well, I've things I've been pretty slow. jealous. Yeah, he was pretty jealous. But I took things slow, but it works really nice. It's like a really... I can tell it's a quality machine, so I'm scared to do anything to mess it up. But these are so cute. I really like these. I'm glad I decided to do those three additions to the shop. I hope people on Etsy like them too. So, huh, are you excited? I've been watching Scout and she's been a little stinker. Yeah, Josh was on daddy duty. She was screaming. Not like... Not she crying. isn't screaming and crying. She isn't screaming in pain. She's just screaming for the yeah. heck of it. She's just crazy. For the halibut. <laughs> so Scout's cloth diapers are being stripped right now. They've actually been in the process of being stripped for how long? The past four hours? Yeah. Oh my goodness gracious. And she's literally wearing like the only diaper we have right now. <laughs> I need to go put her diapers in the dryer. Dryer. Mm. I just got the diapers out of the dryer and they look, they seriously look extra clean. I think this is going to be good. Do you want to do a smell test? Mm. What do you think? They maybe smell a teeny tiny bit like bleach. Maybe I should have rinsed them one more time. But we'll see. We'll see how they are. I think they're going to leak less. <laughs> what are you doing? What are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> Alright guys, we're not going to drag this out. Thank you for watching today's video. Tomorrow I am excited. I'm going to take pictures. Scout is going to be my little model for three more headbands. And I really hope I can get everything ready for the shop tomorrow night so that Friday I can open. Can you tell them to thumbs up? Go like this, Scout. Go thumbs up. Thumbs it up. Thumbs up the video. <laughs> and what? Big thumbs it up, big toe thumb it. Oh, big toe it up. Big toe it up. And subscribe. And we'll see you tomorrow. tomorrow.
you're doing good.